What's up, everybody? It's Buster Posey and Hendrix Boy for the Minecraft Pigs, and we're gonna do a tutorial that has been asked for the most, and that is Zom's mod pack and two reactions. So let's get started. We're gonna go to Safari, and the first thing we're gonna download is Minecraft Jar Tool. We use this in all of our tutorials, so if you already have downloaded that for one of them, you can skip this step. And you're just gonna click on download and wait 44 seconds. So. While we wait, we're going to go on to downloading the rest of the stuff. So, you're going to do Zom's Mod Pack. Remember, all links in the description. Hit current download link. Clicky, clicky. And that'll download. And the other thing, too many items. And remember, you can just search these. They will be the first thing to come up on Google. Click download. And remember, if this helped you, and if it works for you, make sure to favorite this video, like this video, and subscribe, because we've got a lot of cool stuff coming out. Yeah, and just a reminder, we're not tech support. We don't know what your problem is. It works for us. So if it's not working, uh, try force updating your Minecraft and restarting. But other than that, don't know what's happening. As usual, this is on a Mac, by the way. And we're done. So we will tell you things that might solve, like, not solve, but prevent you from having problems. And if you still have that problem, we're not going to help you. Yep, because... screw you. <laughs> All right, Just so kidding. in your downloads folder, right down there, you will see wow, that was a lag. too many items folder. I'm going to drag that to the desktop. Zom's mod pack folder, drag that to the desktop. And Minecraft Jar Tool, put that down there. So we're going to open up Minecraft Jar Tool. Now, what you should remember, if you have downloaded mods before and did it without using the jar tool and you open press the open now button and you have nothing in your MC TMP folder you need to go into Minecraft and force an update and that will solve you do it your like problem. This. We're not going to go through it because it takes a little while but you go options force, force update, update done and then, and then you would log in and it would create new stuff. But yes. Screw so if your MC TMP folder has you nothing in it wait. that's well, why. Now it's going to force update next time so Yes, we're force updating it. As you can see, it's just getting you all of the new stuff, which will solve your problem. This won't delete any of your saves, or your, your texture packs, stats, or achievements. Though. It's just the game itself. And this will get rid of mods if the, mod, mo if the mods fail and you want to restart, that's how you do it. So, we're going to press back up now. You don't have to do this. But we recommend it. Yeah. So, open now. Now you're going to see the MCTMP folder has right. arrived on your desktop. Let's just go ahead and minimize this. So we're going to start with Zom's mod pack. So when you open up that folder, there's going to be all this in there. And as you can see, the first one is classes. We're going to click classes. And in there is going to be a lot of class files, just like are in the MCTMP folder. So we're going to go Apple A to select all, Apple C to copy all. Apple V to paste all. And you're going to remember, apply to all replace. Because if you don't replace, you'll get black screened, and that'll be bad. And then while we're in here, we're going to search Meta. And now we're not going to delete the folder. We're just going to get rid of Mojang files within the folder. So remember that, people. Then we're going to put in... Go back here and close. Uh, go back one. You can just minimize that because you'll be using it in a sec. And now we're going to open up too many items. It's very important that you zoms first. Because if you do not, um, there's something with the files that um, only allows too many items to be put in second or last. Whenever you're putting in a mod with too many items, always do it last. Cancel. I just put two of the same thing in. Trash them. They're all copies. Just trash them. Oh. This is how pro we are with the Minecraft pigs. Um, <laughs> all right, so we're going to put that, copy that into MCTMP, replace, and you are so close to finishing, you do not believe it. Recompile now, and now you'll see the MCTMP folder has been removed from your desktop. And now comes the fun part. Ah, uh, this is not the fun part. He's lying. So we're going to just um, make a new folder in a new second. Finder window. Finder. So. We're going to go to user, ours is the Minecraft pigs, then you're going to go to library, application support, Minecraft, woohoo. Now in there you're going to see you probably do not have this folder so we'll just trash it to show you how it's going to work. Yours won't have mod loader, yours won't have the too many items.txt, 
which will be actually it probably will. No. It no, it won't. All right. And won't have untitled folder. So what we're going to do is create a new folder, and you're going to call that folder mobs. Mob. Mobs. You have to spell it exactly right, or it will not work. And you just made the mods folder. So once you have that, you're gonna go back into the zoms folder, and we're gonna just once again just go into config. Yeah, you're gonna see the config. You're gonna have all these txt. Now go back into the mods folder, and we're gonna make a folder. You have to name this perfectly. Zom, not zoms. Zom. And then you're gonna take all these and put them in to there. Ba Bam. So. In too many, not, not too many items, sorry about that. In um, Zoms, it's a compilation of a lot of different mods. You can go through them if you would like, but we're just going to do Fly Mod for this. We're also going to do Cloud Mod. Yeah, because it's very nice. So, how to get rid of, if you saw right there, Hendrix just got rid of the um, little tick next to the... It's called a pound. Pound next to Mod Cloud Enabled, and you only, you have to get rid of that to enable it, and now... I suggest looking to see what the command is. And we're going to set ours as C. Because that's easy to remember. And you can move clouds up and down, but we're not going to set that. So we're just going to scroll down until we get to fly mod. Do, 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 do. All right, we've arrived. Now, as you can see right there, mod fly enabled. We're going to just delete it. And we like these curls, controls, F, E, and Q. Yep. And if you see right here, it oh, says... Great. Movement speed multiplier, 1.0. Now, this will have you flying at normal walking speed. We prefer 3.5, and we suggest that you use it. And if you'd like to change, you can change any of these. Vertical movement speed. You don't really want to mess around with these too much. Just do minor adjustments and see what it is. That's so, kind of confusing. Yeah. So now... Um, Hold on. I like to change this little... This is what it says. You can. You don't have to do that. Um, yes, you do. We're sun mod. Sun control, which is really yeah, Excuse me for saying that we weren't going to do all these, but these are all just the ones that we really like. Sun mod will allow you to change the time in your game, but it's not actually changing the time. It's just changing what it looks like for you. So if you have it on normal, hard, or insane crazy, as in Minecraft, uh, mob will still spawn during the night. Insane crazy. I don't think that mode has been added to the game yet. Yeah, you can go through these and look at them if you'd like to use them. There's different cheats, all this stuff, and I think that's it. Yep, so we're going to go ahead and save, close, and hope to geez this works. So, let's go into Minecraft and show you what this is all about. Let's go into Minecraft and not get a black screen. Dun dun dun. So no black screen and no. The, if it's not working, you'll see a big, the big red error message there. And that means that you screwed up. So as you can see, I was just screwing around with some portal stuff. If you'd like to watch the portal gun video, link in the description. It's pretty awesome. Actually, the link is right around Whoop for right now. But as with everything in this, it will uh, all be in the description. Where is? I think that's how you spell it. So we'll go in, and once it gets in, we will show you what this is all about. Now, you may have noticed that F and Q were part of my flight controls, so I have to go and change my fog and drop controls, but I don't mind that. So, here we are in the game. Difficulty peaceful, controls, and we're just going to change fog to M and drop to P. Now, when we go back to the game... Mm. Render distance. It's all on really short because we were exporting some stuff. So. Alright, now it's good. Now when you press I, You'll see that when you press F, you will fly around and... you see that I'm a birdie. Your different controls that you set for up and down will be up and down in the air. And when you press I or E, whatever you have, you'll see you have all the items and you can just click on them to now, spawn yourself stuff. And you Hendrix will show you around it. Stacks, you go shift click and it'll give you a regenerating stack of snow stone, for example. So I'll just make a little smiley face here. And you'll see it's at 106, but then if I hit open again, it'll just regenerate. And as you can see on the left, there's all these saves. So what we suggest doing for the saves, say you give yourself these tools and you always want to have them. Bam, when you click load one, 
and you delete all, if you click that again, it'll automatically give you that, and if you click the X. So, another helpful thing, the trash. So, yep. say you've filled up your inventory with all this crappy diamond ore, you can either drop it in the trash or shift, and it'll delete all. And if you want to get infinite tools, just shift-click on those tools. And as you can see, when we use them, it doesn't run out. And another thing, want to get infinite armor, shift-click armor, and you will have full health, and you will be invincible. All right, and then let's just tour around all those other mods we set in Zoms as we change our fog here. So we did sun control, so let's find sun. Wee! And you might notice this isn't actually changing the time for the game, it's just changing what it looks like for you. You can do this in multiplayer, and it'll look day always for you. So that right. might be nice. And, and we also had weather control, so thunder. make it thundering. So, which is not good, so I'll just stop that. Yeah. And we also can do lightning. Let's find it. Let's find it. a pig or a sheep or something. That's how hardcore we are. Let's find a pig. We're going to make zombie pigmen. As we fly around, um, we would like to remind you, if this helped you, make sure to hit the thumbs up button, leave a comment saying that it helped you, and make sure to subscribe for more content. Yeah, we got... we're pushing... Uh, 150 subs here, quite quickly. And we're not saying this is official, but there might just be a contest that you can get some awesome stuff. You know what? I'm not finding any pigs, so it's time to get a pig spawner. Now oh, this is gonna hurt. And we suggest this mod, to, these mods to use if you are ever trying to apply for our server, which you can do by making a video of your best creation ever and sending us a personal message with it in it. I pwned him. So, this has been Buster Posey. And that guy you always love so much, Hendrix Boy. For the Minecraft Pigs, we will see you next time. Make now, sure to thumbs now up. Now to drown. No, thumbs up. Make sure to thumbs up this Next video. Make sure to thumbs up. Make sure you're always using DokuCraft, too. Yeah, I hate normal. Use DokuCraft. That's not that bad, but... So, if you would like to go see how to install the Portal Gun mod... Let's, let's go somewhere interesting. Again. Yeah, so we can get some awesome stuff. This is pretty interesting. Click on that fat piece of gravel if you want to see Portal Gun. Click on those trees in front of me if you want to see our latest server showcase. And if you want to see how to install texture packs, click I'm a birdie. Yep. That is HD Texture Packs with MC Patcher, and if you want to see some cool stuff, click on the secret annotation, which is hiding. Bye-bye.